Hey you guys, it's your girl Shola, P-R-O-M-O-S-T-K, Shola's Creations Way. You guys, I've just made the best baked spaghetti, mm, 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 mouth-watering goodness with some good old mm, homemade garlic bread. Look at that spaghetti. Oh, take that bite, take that bite. Mm, mm, good. Okay. Don't forget, check us out with the mukbang at P-R-O-M-O-S-T-K, eating good in the neighborhood. Oh, yeah. All right, you guys, so these are the ingredients for our meat that's going to go in our sauce for our homemade spaghetti. Oh, yeah. All right, you guys, and these are all the ingredients that's going to be going into our spaghetti sauce mm -mm -mm, for our homemade spaghetti. Oh, yeah. All right, you guys, and this will be going on our mm -mm -mm, garlic toast, homemade garlic toast. All right, stay tuned. All right, you guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get two things started. Oh yeah, two things started. I'm gonna get my little, my little handy dandy mats because I have a problem with the germ. Now, y'all saw from the pictures, I had a whole large onion. I took it in half, half is gonna go in my sauce, the other half is gonna go in my fry pan with my meat. So I'm gonna go ahead and I took my onion, as you can see here, I took half and half and I put them in these little bowls and I put them in the microwave so they can get a little glycerin. I like to do that before I start cooking them. And it just really amplifies the flavor. Oh yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and drop these onions in there now. And that's the pan that the, the meat is gonna go in. I have two different types of meat. I have my ground beef and I have my hot Italian sausages. And I'm just gonna take them out of the casing. So while those onions are in a pan is oiled with like a teaspoon of uh, vegetable oil. So while that is getting heated up, I'm gonna go ahead and start putting my sauces in my pot here. So we got two different types of sauces. We got a marinara and we have a meat. A meat sauce. Let me use this. There we go. So we're gonna go ahead and put these sauces in there. And I'm gonna add just a little bit of water, but I'm gonna take my jars that still have a little sauce in them and I'm gonna put the water in there. So about maybe a half a cup of water. I don't know if any of you guys do that, but I like to utilize the rest of my sauce instead of wasting it. Okay. And this is great value sauce. There we go. Now I had it on high when I first turned the eye on, so I'm just gonna turn it on about medium. And while the sauce is on, I'm gonna go ahead and add my mushroom and I am gonna put the entire can in there. It is a eight ounce can. We love the mushrooms. Make sure you wipe the tops of the cans off before you incorporate with your food. So we're gonna put the juice in all, you guys, juice in all. That's why I only use a half a cup of my uh, water. There we go. Also to that sauce, we're gonna add some garlic. This is minced garlic, probably about a tablespoon. Yeah, maybe two, depending on how you like garlic. We're gonna put some onion powder. Okay. And that's about a teaspoon. And we're gonna put some garlic powder. Do y'all know 
don't follow John Gullick kind of clumping up too. I do. I don't know what makes it do that, but. So we're going to use about a tablespoon of each. That's the onion powder and the garlic powder. Give these little onions a little stir. We're going to go ahead and add the other half of the onions into my sauce here. sauce I'm gonna add uh, let's see what I'm gonna add a little bit of black pepper it's about a teaspoon of black pepper okay we're gonna get some little stir now we're gonna let this just simmer simmer down I'm gonna put a little, about a tablespoon of sugar in here. Just a little tablespoon. So I have to go up here and get it. <laughs> All right, so again, tablespoon of sugar. I always like to add a little sugar to my sauce. Get a little stir. Now we're just going to let this cook down some. I'm not going to add my saran wrap to it because I want it to cook down. Now I'm coming back over here now because now I'm going to start putting my hamburger meat in with my um Y'all can see I am cooking on my on my actual stove top. It's an um, electric stove top to eye burner. And I am really enjoying this. Alright, so I'm gonna let that cook down. And while that is cooking down, I'm gonna go ahead and take these out of these casings. Real simple, you guys. Real simple. And this is a little spicy, so that's why I did not add any um, other spices as far as heat. So I'm just gonna pull that casing off and just put that meat in there like that. And this pack comes with five of these sausages. And we're gonna use them all. So this is going to be a very meaty spaghetti. That ground beef, that was about, I would say about two pounds of ground beef. How many out there like Italian sausages?
I love it in my spaghetti. Some people grill them, but I love them in my spaghetti and on pizza. Oh yeah. I will be also incorporating another pack that I have and some pizza that I'm gonna be doing. I don't know when yet because pizza's not on my menu anytime soon. I think it was hot and heavy with pizza a while back. There we go. and just get this all mixed up until it's all brown. So we got some pieces in here that's a little frozen still, but that's okay. I'm gonna speed this up so we'll get to the finished ground beef. I'm gonna also be boiling my noodles. Y'all don't have a see me boiling noodles. Y'all know what noodles. Uh, how to boil noodles. If you don't, you can always read the instructions on there. Now, to this meat, I'm also going to add some complete badia. About two teaspoons. I'm going to add some Worcestershire sauce, about two tablespoons. I love this in my ground beef. I haven't had this sausage before, so I'm hoping it turns out good. So, about two tablespoons of that. black pepper to that. About a tablespoon. We're gonna add some onion powder. About a teaspoon, so we already have those onions in there. And we're gonna also add some garlic powder. Yeah, we're gonna let this brown up. I'm gonna fast forward this. Now it's time to drain 
the meat and bring it back. And as you see, the spaghetti sauce has already rendered and has reduced. All right, you guys, so now that everything is almost ready, we have our casserole pans right here. Oh yeah, it's gonna be baked spaghetti, y'all. We have our noodles. And you wanna make sure that your noodles are like El, da um, El Dente. <laughs> So we'll do half, that was a pack of spaghetti noodles. So we'll make sure we get an even amount in both bowls. Okay. There we go. They're steaming hot. All right. So what we're gonna do with these noodles, let's shake, shake, shake. Shake, 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 shake your noodles. All right, now we have two different types of cheese. We have the Fiesta blend, and we have our mozzarella. Oh yeah. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take and we're gonna use both these cheeses. So we're gonna put a little mozzarella cheese on here. Oh yeah, we're being generous with the cheese. Real generous. Fiesta blend cheese and do the same. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we're gonna put our sauce on here. Oh yeah, and this sauce is ready. Ready, ready. All right. Now let me get my soup ladle. this off here and we're gonna get in my soup ladle and we're just gonna ladle it on like so all this goodness starting from the top all oh, yeah I'll get three maybe four ladles on here Thank you. 
so get about a, a ladle of good old juice make sure that's in there all right so this one's done now we're going to do the same for this one so we're going to have one for me mm -hmm. and one for herbie one for me and one for herbie oh yeah please don't hesitate to go to promo stk eating good in the neighborhood and watch us mukbang this thing and see how it turns out oh yeah now we got all this goodness we're gonna do a little shake 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 now we're gonna top it off with mozzarella. Yes, y'all, some more mozzarella. Yeah, got two good handfuls of that mozzarella in there. And then we're gonna put it in the oven and bake it for about hmm, 20 minutes till it gets all uh, bubbly because you know everything's done. There we go. All right, so we'll see you guys back at the table. Once it's all baked up, again, put it in the oven at 350 for about 20 minutes. Mm. See you guys in a few. And we're going to be on to the bread. Oh, yeah. All right, you guys. So while we have the spaghetti baking in the oven, we're going to go ahead and prepare for our bread. I have one softened stick of margarine. You can use butter. We're going to put about a tablespoon of this... Um, garlic powder there we go and we're gonna put about two tablespoons of minced garlic all right that should be good right there two tablespoons now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take and just mash up that soft butter like so Rub it, dub it, dub down, okay? And then by the time it gets um, ready to go in the oven, the, the spaghetti will be almost on its last few minutes and everything will be finishing up together, okay? So that's all you're gonna do with this garlic butter. You're just gonna spread it on. And remember, you want your garlic toast, well, we like our garlic toast hard. We like a crunchy. So you can have it crunchy or you can have it not so crunchy. But I do have parchment paper, as y'all see, as my base liner. You can put, um, just leave it in the pan or. So we're gonna let these bake in the oven, oven, oven for about, mm, 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 about 15 minutes. Look at that, oh yeah. All right, you guys, so this is the finished product. This is the baked spaghetti, made Shell's Creations way. One for me and one for Frank. And this is our good old garlic toast bread y'all see me make. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. Look at that. Oh yeah. It's gonna be so good. Oh yeah. Let's get into this cheesy baked spaghetti again. Look at that. Oh. Y'all see all that, that goodness down up in there. See that goodness? Look at that. Ooh, yeah. Mm. Come on and eat with us at P R O M O S C K. Eating good in the neighborhood. This
this was made in here. From OSCK, Shella's Creations Way. Oh, yeah. Now, y'all, come on over to P-R-O-M-O-S-T-K, eating good in the neighborhood, and watch the full mukbang of this thing. But we're going to give you a little teaser. Just a little teaser. So come on over. What's up? What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Shella. And Fred. P-R-O-M-O-S-T-K. Eating good in the neighborhood. This and we have, you guys... Baked spaghetti, oh, made Shell's Creations way. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, Ground mm, beef mm, mm, and some good old hot mm, mm, mm. Italian salsa juice. Oh, yeah. We have our husband and blessed food, and we're going to get it in. And the Father, we thank you for last night rest. We thank you for a line of seal that we've never seen before, Heavenly Father. Bless this food for the my body. Bless the hand that bird. Bless the one who don't have no food, Heavenly Father. Bless the ones in the hospital, the nursing home, even the ones who travel on the highway. Bless our servants, women, uniform, and Father. And bless our government, and Father. That they do the right thing, and Father. What God wants them to do, and Father. Bless this household, and we'll be blessing others. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. Hopefully, yes. you guys. Oh, that's the. Bib time, y'all. Hopefully, you guys. The uh, recording to go out. So I got to delete some stuff off my memory. So hopefully we don't lose here. this video footage. Ooh, really? no. I got my beer ball. Well, I did my daily thing. And I'm going to put down. my um, paper towel on because this is going to be messy, y'all. It's going to be messy. Let me get my, ooh, y'all. I'm so excited. I'm going to get, get y'all the first. I'm going to get y'all the first. I'm going to get y'all the first. Ooh, look at I you. I got to slide mine down. Shut up, y'all. I'm going to get y'all the first bite. Why are you just picking up my right head when you get your picture? There you go. Mm. Uh, Let's see. Who's hot? You damn right it's hot. Burn your damn lips off. <laughs> no, I ain't trying to be funny. That, mm -mm. that stuff is hot, girl. Mm. That stuff mm. is hot. Mm. Stuff is hot, y'all. I did my duties for the day. Mm -hmm. These four little ones down had they, they had their little bag. And my little and garlic bread. They just the happiest they can mm. be. Remember, I told y'all about that crunch? Mm -hmm. Let me see. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Hey, y'all yeah, getting that cake? Another. Right. Mm. 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 No. So we got sausage. Don't dress. forget, go to my cooking channel. Y'all see exactly how I prepared this. Three different items coming together as one meal. Sausage. Hold on, man. Mm. I bet you won't think you've got to put it mm. in, but you probably won't plan on putting it. The pepperoni. You won't plan on putting it. Won't plan on putting no pepperoni in there. Why? Change it too much of us. It's a mm. lot of meat in here. Yeah. Mm. I'm going to eat y'all some more. Sour cream. Mm. Babe, I didn't put no sour cream in this. No, I wouldn't really go good right now. Mm. I don't know. Mm. Me, dog, me, dog, about to put my underwear down. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. You got mushrooms? Y'all stop, Junior. Mm. Hope everybody having a blessed day today. Stop, Junior. Mm. It's hot. You got mushroom? Mm -hmm. That's mushroom. Mm. 
Yeah, I put a whole eight ounce can of mushrooms in. I should know you gonna put mushrooms. I love mushrooms, y'all. Mm. I thought they had a shell going around eating spaghetti with a uh, mayonnaise. Thought about it, I'm like, I'm not gonna mess up my good old spaghetti. Eat spaghetti with mayonnaise. Mm -hmm. What? Put it in there or? Put it in there. What? At, like right here. Put some mayonnaise. You want to put some? Oh no, no, I ain't doing that. No, no. <laughs> give me to do something. I ain't never done before. I ain't never eaten mayonnaise. Mm. 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 Kind of remind me of lasagna. You gotta be on home to meet y'all. You know what? You're right. Let me y'all that let me y'all let me y'all that To watch the rest of the mukbang, y'all join us at P R O M O S T K in good and neighborhood. Oh yeah.